uh, there's something that exists that is outdated and they, they need to get it rid of it. And that is the stupid password dots. I get it. They're meant to protect you against, I guess, the person over your shoulder who's watching you type it in. That's what they're meant to do. But what they really turn out to be is a guarantee you're going to get your password wrong. Because you can't see what you're typing. You get distracted. You're like, oh, shit, what number was I on? Uh, Delete. I got to go back to the beginning. Did I uppercase that letter? Uh, I have no idea. Go back to the beginning. Do it again. It is more effective at annoying the hell out of me than it is protecting me from the possible person who's lurking over my soul. Because how many times are you are you typing passwords in where people are looking over your shoulders? Uh, 1%, 0%. That 1% that somebody might be looking over your shoulders, maybe that's the one time you could just turn to them and go, hey, uh, what are you doing? I'm about to type in my password. That's it. For all the aggravation you cause, you're protecting maybe an incident that is as likely as winning the lottery. But, oh, boy, do you annoy the fuck out of me. You know how many computers I've broken because I've thrown the keyboard through my television set because I'm like, why still in 2024 do we have to have the dots? They do nothing. And on that same note, stop sending me notifications telling me that my passwords are compromised. Oh boy, you've used the same password on like 10 multiple sites. Yeah, you know why? Because I'm a human being and I have a shitty memory. We all do. Sorry. I know that if I use your generated password, it's more secure. But oh, God help me if I can't remember it. Or if I can't access it, I'm terrified every time I use one of those because I think there's zero way I'll ever get my password back because I have no idea what all these symbols and letters are. So I have to hope that there's a reset password option just in case it doesn't pull it up automatically. So yeah, I have a lot of passwords that are similar. So. But they tell me, oh, you better change it. And then I make the mistake. Well, all right, maybe I'll change it. And then four hours later, after nothing works and it doesn't save the new password or you go to confirm it. And because of those stupid dots, you're not even sure if you're confirming it correctly. And then it tells you invalid password. And then eight hours later, you're just thinking I should have just left it. The way it was, because honestly, even if somebody wants to hack me, what are they going to do to me? I'm broke. And I should have gone to, I called in sick to just change all my passwords because I have 4,700 of them. And uh, now I lost that money and none of my passwords work now. My point is, Life is hard.